Hi, this is Jim Thomas, and we're going to talk about Chapter 8, which is uh, Long-Term Investments and the Time Value of Money. So this could be a lot of fun for some of you. Anyway, Long-Term Investments deals with things like stocks and bonds. We're going to be looking at uh, available for sale investments, health and maturity investments, equity investments greater than 20%. Um, less than 20%, more than 50%, boy, we're going to have a great time. And we're also going to talk about the time value of money, which is probably a new concept for many of you. So there's two ways we can look at the time value of money. We have a $1,000 today, how much will it grow to in, say, five years, okay, at 10%, and we can figure that out. If we get $1,000 every year for five years and we invested in 10 percent how much will that be worth it's probably a lot more the other side of the coin is called present value so what is the value today of some cash flow in the future at a discount rate right so how much money would we need to set aside today if it grows at a certain rate to create this cash flow in the future and again, the other side of that is how much money would we have to save today to make a payment every year for five years at a certain discount rate. And we'll be looking at that too. So I hope you have fun and it should be a challenging chapter.